It's your funeral. Why leave it to others? Mixed feelings. Making plans for the future brings mixed feelings. It's right to concentrate on the good things, but sometimes there are things you would rather not think about. A funeral is one of those. You may not have considered planning a funeral in advance, but there are several reasons why it can bring great peace of mind. Bereavement usually brings with it emotional and financial burdens. However, you can spare your loved ones much of the burden of having to make difficult decisions in an upsetting time. And it's so true. If you don't have your things in place before something were to happen to you, it will cause a lot of stress and also cause your family to lose a lot of money. As this picture shows, confused, lost, unclear, perfect, disoriented, bewildered, your family will be all that and having to make decisions at a very bad time. Look at this funeral cost. The cost of many funerals has more than doubled in the last 10 years and prices are set to continue to increase in the future. If you have savings set aside for your funeral, you can never be sure that that would be enough or you may be setting aside more than you really need. It makes good sense to guard against unknown price rises. A prepaid funeral plan is the way to absolutely certain that the services of the funeral director will be provided and there will be nothing more to pay for those services. Let's look at this picture of the average funeral cost. Professional services, $1,750. A casket, $4,300. The ceremony itself, $175. Disbursements, uh, death and cremation certification, and all other payments that you have to make, $725. And the actual burial, just to be put in the ground, $2,100. A cremation, as hard as it to believe, is going anywhere between $3,500 and $9,000. A burial is going from $5,000 all the way up to $20,000, depending on how much you want to spend. But the average cost is $9,000. Avoid family stress. Bereaved relatives usually arrange a funeral and may be unsure what's actually wanted. It helps to do something at times of sadness, but it's not a good time to make important decisions, which, if wrong, cannot be put back right later. Planning ahead for your funeral can be a great help in alleviating the emotional and financial burdens that naturally accompany bereavement and those who remain will remember your thoughtfulness. It's so true. You know, this is a gift, your final gift, by preparing everything in advance. There are also some quiet satisfaction to be gained from putting your affairs in order and reflecting on the most appropriate arrangements. People worry that their wishes will not be carried out. It is important to realize that any funeral wishes set out in your will or other letters or documents are are only requests. Your executors are under no obligation to carry out your wishes. However, if you own a prepaid funeral plan, your guarantee is with a funeral director and your wishes are set out in your guaranteed certificate. Prearranged funeral. When you prearrange your funeral with your prepaid funeral plan, you can decide on your funeral service and select a suitable arrangement. Set on a method of payment to match your circumstances. Select who benefits under the plan. Have comfort, reassurance, and freedom from worry and stress. Ensure no hidden extras are charged. Now, this is so true. But there is a way called funeral expense insurance or final expense insurance, which costs you a minimal amount for the benefit that you get. What is final expense insurance? Final expense insurance will pay for your funeral expenses as well as any accumulated debts at the end of your life, which could include nursing home costs not covered by Medicare. Senior citizens used to refer to it as burial insurance. I just did. Why do I need it? Funerals are expensive and the price continues to rise. Even without a plot and headstone, the average funeral costs more than $9,000, and that amount has risen more than 10 times since the 1960s. Most people don't want to leave this burden to their heirs. 
Are there different types of policy? Yes. You can purchase a whole life final expense insurance policy that covers you until your death, or you can buy a cheaper term life policy that only provides coverage until you reach the age specified in the policy. Final expense insurance policies offer varying amounts of coverage and premiums. MedLife sells a $2,500 policy costing $10 a month for a 45-year-old woman because she's expected to live to age 82. When should I buy it? You can purchase a final expense insurance policy anytime between the ages of 45 and 85. So even though you're in the 60s or 70s, you can still get a policy. Remember that the cost of the policy is lower when purchased at an early age since you will be paying into it a longer period of time. What insurance company do I work for? Well, I'm an independent insurance agent. I work for you, not the insurance companies, to get you the best possible rate for the most coverage. Can you purchase your coverage from us online? Yes, we are different from other insurance agents. Most of the application enrollments are done online while you stay in the comfort of your home. I work for you, not the insurance companies. How do you contact me? My phone, 845-380-5809. My email, insuredmets at gmail.com. You can write me at Bill Vargas, 1145 Route 55, Suite 3, LaGrangeville, New York. 12540, or go to my website and get an instant quote, or email me through the website, and I'll get right back to you. What other services do I offer? Uh, we offer retirement planning, life insurance, Medicare supplement, and Medicare Advantage plan, final expense insurance, and a full line of financial services. Get a free, no obligation quote now. Go right to the site. Click what you're looking for, and I'll get back to you within 24 hours. Please share, subscribe, and help everybody else in your family prepare for something that could be very stressful. Thanks again. Please share me with your family and friends. See you on the next video. Bye-bye.